With the unemployment numbers so high across the country, we wanted to take a close, closer look rather at what they are here in Western New York. And two on your sides, Kelly Dudzik is breaking them down for us and letting us know what the governor had to say today about the issues people are still having getting their unemployment benefits. Kate, today the governor said he understands the unemployment benefits are problematic and not enough. This as the unemployment rate continues to climb. And the bills keep coming, right? Nobody put the bills on pause. You know, those people are still, everybody's still sending a bill. So that's a tremendous pressure on people. Compared to the same week last year, the Western New York region has seen initial unemployment claims increase by 414%. While that is huge, it's the second smallest increase in the state. Central New York saw a jump of nearly 1,200%. Compared to last year, as a region, Western New York's initial claims jumped from around 2,500 for the week ending May 2nd in 2019 to more than 13,000 for the same week this year. The governor was asked, when will people finally get their benefits? He said every state in the country has seen a huge increase in people applying for unemployment and did not give a timeline. That takes a system that design, was designed to handle hundreds of applications. It now handles thousands of applications. It's overwhelmed every state system, period. Uh, and we have uh, our response rate is far better than most states, even though our population is far greater. Tonight, new first at five, you'll hear from a woman from Kenmore. She says the unemployment benefit system needs to be fixed, and she's been waiting for her money since April. In Buffalo, Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News.